Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Chris at MD Tech Channel. Please subscribe if you have not yet subscribed and click to get all of my new updated videos that are coming out weekly. And to all those followers, thank you for following and please share. Today we're gonna to be talking about specifically creating a link for customers to write reviews on your Google My Business location page. And we'll talk about why it's important, how to do it, and what the benefit of it is. So many of you may ask, what actually is Google My Business? Well, Google My Business is a free and easy to use tool for businesses such as myself and organizations to manage their online presence across Google, including the search and maps. Okay, it helps customers find your business and tell them your story so you can verify your business and edit your business information. Um, also, if you were to type in the name under here, Alan Yacht, you'd see it come up and you'd see the Google My Business uh, details information come up here. I would type their name into Google and their Google listing would come up. Okay, we can go ahead and try that by just going to google.com and typing it in. Now, that's from the customer standpoint. From the business owner standpoint, what are the benefits of having Google My Business? Well, there's many of them and too many to actually include in this video, but in general, managing your information, okay? The information you're gonna provide Google users when they do find your business is you know, endless. Not only the products or services, uh, your times open, closed, contact numbers, you know, we all rely on that. You know, we Google a business and see, oh, they're open. Bam, we can go. And the reviews that people leave and the photos. So if you're like me and you're trying to look for business, you Google it and you look at the review and say, wow, they have a lot of reviews, but many are bad. Or they have few reviews, but they're good. You know, what do you go with? What is better? And, um, you know, how do you decide on which business or product or service to use? So uh, here we'll go through how to actually create a Google My Business link to use for your own business. And it's quite simple. And uh, we'll start by actually, by actually doing it here ourselves. Where we could also do it on our mobile phone. But let's start by going back home to google.com. And as you see here, you got your dots. We'll go over to the dots and we'll make sure we go into my business. And under my business, since I'm a web developer, software developer, I do SEO, I'm gonna have several different businesses under this. All right, but I'm gonna look specifically at one business. Why don't we locate our own business and that is USA Web Designs. I can click on this. It's a business I registered with Google, my business. Left menu, you're gonna see home, and we are at the home location, and you're gonna go down, and you're gonna see something that says, get more reviews card, and you can copy your short URL to share with customers. Before, it was a lot more difficult. Um, now, it's a, it's a lot more easy. So, I'm gonna scroll down till I find get more reviews and we see here get more reviews share your business profile and get new reviews from customers so i'm going to click this and it's going to give me a link to copy now all i can do i can copy this link and i can paste it i can email it i can have it in an email i send out so that customers can review um, remember the more reviews the better and hopefully they're positive we'll go over the benefits of it in a little bit um, and we're not going to necessarily talk about how to create the Google My Business, but what I'm showing you is how to get that link for more reviews and what you can do with it. So you can share it on social media, or you can also put it on a web page, perhaps that you created. So you can always put it into the header or footer or into your website in any different location and link to it. When I go ahead and I paste this exact uh, information, what's gonna come up is a review form. So I can share this with my customers, that link. And that link will basically allow my customers to add photos and review me. So that's a quick and easy way. Send a link to your customers 
and they can review you. So other great options for you if you've now have this link uh, to request reviews is put it on your business card and do it in a way that when you take a picture of your business card, it has a QR code, which will take the person directly to the review post and they can review. So here we go. We have the link. I'm copying it and I'm just going to go in Google and I'm going to look for, you know, a free QR code generator one we have here and it says free text or URL. We'll type in a URL here. All right. And we could also hit shorten. And this URL is going to take us exactly to this URL here. Okay. So this is the static QR code. Now, if I was to put this image on a business card, you can simply take your phone up to it with the camera ready to take a picture and it should sense and know that this is a QR code and take you exactly to that same review form. So this is a great tool. And, and here you can see I just put my camera over it. It recognizes it and takes you right to the review website. Simple as that. It matters more so now than ever in this information age. You know, Google business reviews and reviews in general matter more than anything before. Before it was word of mouth. Now we are dealing with a whole different, you know, type of business. All right. Consumers are turning to online reviews more so than ever when making purchasing decisions. They trust them more and they're actively reviewing businesses on a more frequent basis. When I go out to dinner, I'm going to review them. I'm going to review them. If I have something bad to say, I'll say it. You know, hopefully it'll improve, you know, their business practices or whatever, but I'll review them. And if, if I if I find something good, I'll give them a good review. Um, most consumers will read reviews before making a decision. So you want to have your Google My Business set up for your business, okay? And there's been studies done, and I'm not going to go over the studies, but people trust online reviews as much as personal recommendations. Apparently, 84% of people trust online reviews as much as, much as personal recommendations. Okay, so, but again, this also means they can work for or against you, depending on the nature of the reviews. Okay, you want to ask consumers, you know, who you trust to review you. All right, just place reminders around your store, on your website or email and text them and leave a review of your service. And they will. If you ask people to do it, I think they'll do it a lot of times. So, Consistent new reviews can increase consumer trust and um, maximizing positive reviews can pay quick dividends. Um, you know, everyone's heard of local search engine rankings and SEO. Well, Google reviews improve local search rankings or simply put search engine optimization SEO. So you'll want to do it. You want to get your Google My Business set up. Any website or um, business we set up, in my company, we are always doing Google My Business for them. Okay, it's a simple process and the outcomes can be amazing if the client, you know, does ask for reviews from the customers. Um, it, it, the Google reviews will give you credibility boost, you know, without having to spend a dime. You don't have to spend much money at all, actually zero. And you know, the benefits of getting Google reviews include Google ranking for local SEO, like we said. You know, when somebody searches web development, software development in a certain town, you know, my business will come up. All right. 97% of consumers read online reviews for local businesses in 2017 with 12% looking for a local business online every day. I mean, that's just stupid facts there. But, you know, there are best practices. Um that are set out by Google and you can go ahead uh, and review them and they get reviews on Google. They encourage your customers to spread the word about your business with the best practices of verify your business, remind customers to leave reviews and reply to reviews to build your customer's trust. See, if somebody has a bad experience, sure, you want them, you know, they may want you to reply and, you know, ensure that they're trying to do the best thing and, you know, the next time they come back, they'll make it better. Um,
But again, in the past, it was more difficult to find that short code to the Google uh, review. And now they've made it much simpler. Okay, they've made it much simpler to manage your reviews and also uh, to share that review um, link. And as I said, if you are at home in Google here and we go to our dots up here and we go over onto my business and I have several businesses under here, we will go to one of them and you'll see the reviews here on the left, verifications, links to add settings. So I'm gonna to go to this one again, which is my business and I'm going to stay at the home location and you see all these different sections okay so yeah search views are down all right great so I can create a post here um, latest reviews haven't had one recently but you know here you can show you can reply and it's important to reply to the reviews and you know because you want to build that customer trust and engagement You know, thank you for your kind review. It's very appreciated. Okay. And like we said, um, if you want to get more reviews, you do what we said. And that was share the review form. Click here and copy this into, and share it into any social media via email. Or like I said, Go to a QR code generator, generate one of these, and put it onto a business card or onto any paper that you know gets handed out to customers for that reason. So essentially that's all I wanted to go over today was how to actually share your Google My Business review and explain a little bit as to why it's so important and why you should have it. Um, you can do it also on your mobile phone, which we'll show, but get out there and review and reply to those reviews if you're a business owner and understand that this can have significant impacts positively on your business and your revenue. Any questions, please leave a question. I answer them and uh, please tell your friends to subscribe to my channel tips and tricks on everything tech all right you want to see a video you tell me what type of video you want to see and we'll do it again this is chris at md tech thanks again for watching